Hi guys! Hi aunties! Um, we're coming to do a video. I'm sorry I look a mess. I just literally got out of bed. <laughs> but I wanted to do a video with Misa since she hasn't been in one for a while. And we wanted to change her into something for Disney Monday. Since I have her and Ginger's clothes all picked out for Disney Monday. And um, it's kind of hard to change a toddler in the camera view without you know having somebody hold it especially since i don't have like a tripod yet it's even harder and i don't want to knock this because my phone's literally near a hole so i don't want to um, knock you guys down <laughs> and have you guys mia with the dust bunnies because i'm sure there's some back there my room is totally a mess my nursery it's like when you start looking for one outfit, you want to pull all the rest of the outfits out and look at them like, oh, I have this. And it's gotten very, very uh, messy, especially with all the back and forth. And I want to have time with them. So, and her hair is still the same, but I love it. It's really cute. And I really can't do anything else with it. Since it's rooted so, like, patchy. I'm very particular about the rooting. and I only have a couple of people's rooting techniques that I like. But, um... I just haven't had the chance to send anybody off to go get their hair done. And if I do get her redone, it's it's like not going to be just her hair. It's going to be her eyelashes, her hair, her skin. Because I really don't like the painting, whoever did it. It's swipey. It looks kind of like a canvas. You can see lines. I don't know why. but And I don't know the artist, so I really couldn't tell you. And she's going to wear these pants with it since it's really cute. We are supposed to be going to Gaithersburg today. Um, I didn't really plan it, but I had saved money back for a baby that I've been wanting. But I might spend that money and wait to save since it's so close to my birthday. And I want to, like, really do stuff, but it's just not working. <laughs> working out for me right now. So I was hoping to sell him, that way I can at least get on a short layaway plan and have something for my birthday, plus the new baby and... Alrighty. You see everybody? You haven't had a passy for a while. Do you tell them why? Do you tell them you gave it away? You gave your pacifier away to the pacifier fairy. Uh, we didn't upload that video either. We um, put her passies in a balloon and you know, sent them up. But um, we'll probably have to... She's got plenty of passies to do another video like that. We won't give the good ones away, will we? We'll go get some parent choice ones or something. And try to do another video. Um, She's got her mucklucks that I'm going to put her on. Because I hate her feet showing. I don't even know which way these things go on. And they're really, really tight. Like, the small hole and the big, wide foot. Like, I couldn't even get it on Ginger. Let alone a real kid. But, you know, the real kitties lose their shoes all the time. Ooh. And her foot really isn't that big. Um... But yeah, anyways, I'm going to Gaithersburg Mall, where they have an H&M, hopefully. Um, hopefully I get to go in there, and they have some different baby stores. So, two-hour trip for us. <laughs> in more Chick-fil-A. Sorry, I say it Chick-fil-A, everybody else says Chick-fil-A, but in school, this is my argument, in school, my teachers, when we did music class, you know, fa, so, la, ti, do, 
So that was my argument to everybody who always makes fun of me for saying it like that. But law in school was a note. And law is in, you know, chicken for law. So why not call it chicken for law instead of chicken filet? But I'm different. I'm different. Yeah, I'm different. I'm different. Yeah, I'm different. You want to take your hair out? I haven't had her hair out, guys. So, oops, sorry. I lost you guys. It's really hard to do it without a tripod. I wish I had one. Well, I'd rather have a shopping spree. I don't think she's sealed on the inside because her hair comes out in globs all the time. Um, you know, without me, even with me being really careful, so. I really just kind of stopped doing that since I'm okay with it falling out because it's going to be rerouted. But I love giving her these different styles. It's been in this style for a very long time. If you see her in every video, just about she's had this hairstyle. But I worked really hard on it. She never stays still. And, um... I'm loving all the subs that I'm giving, but I notice with the more subs you get, the more dislikes on your video you get. But my question to a lot of people is, why sub to me if you're going to dislike my videos? Like, don't watch if you don't like it. And just move on if you dislike it. I don't give anybody thumbs down on any video that they do because it takes time out of their day. They work hard on it. And for you to sit there and dislike somebody's video is kind of rude. So, and if you don't like the price that I'm selling my doll for, I suggest you just save up or move on. <sighs> Sorry, I'm not a nice person. <laughs> if you see me out in my workplace, I don't talk to people. I don't conversate because I'm just kind of disgusted with today's people. You know, they are good people, but the only good people I've happened to meet were in the community and... You know, that's where I put all my energy towards, you know, you guys. Because you guys understand. And you're people I can talk to. Like, <laughs> people these days, you really just can't freely talk to them without them, you know, being so judgmental. Um, every time I go to um, Jimboree or something, I... So they always ask me, oh, who are you buying for? You know, it's always a different person. And I'm like, oh, my dolls. <laughs> and, you know, you get that stare like, oh, okay. I'm not going to help her anymore. Like, she said I didn't need help anymore finding an outfit. But, you know, some people's argument is that you have reborns. You shouldn't buy them real stuff. Or, you know... You shouldn't be getting stuff that is meant for real babies. But this is why they mass produce stuff. I mean, they wouldn't... I mean, they got diapers out there. They've got, you know, wipes and a lot of things. Because there's more than just babies that use diapers. Think about it. People that have monkeys have diapers. People who have... Um, some people like me. Like, you know, when you're on your monthly thing, you want baby wipes, right? Right? So, <laughs> it's not just for people with babies. And they're always thinking, you know, just because you buy formula, you get free formula that you're taking away from mothers in need. But this is why they leave stuff out there for those moms. If they don't, you know, voluntarily go out there and get the free stuff, that's, you know, not my problem. <laughs> but, you know, they can do that. There's lots of people that do. Everybody can sign up. Anybody can sign up. You know, my husband, he could sign up. Call him my husband because he ain't going nowhere. <laughs> so, I mean, there's... Anybody can get free baby stuff, you know. So all the people that are out here rambling on people's video... <coughs> Sorry, that hairspray gets me choky. <laughs> um, always commenting on videos, you should have that stuff for that's for real babies and this and that. Well, there's a lot of moms that can't afford it. And, you know, if I could reach all those moms to help them out, I would. I've helped out a lot of people. 
And, you know, every time I give somebody something, they're a little ungrateful. So, I don't give away anything for my Reborns anymore. Like, unless I'm doing a giveaway, which I haven't got to do yet. Which I'm waiting until I get a little bit more subs, but not for the giveaway part. Um, I'm just doing it because I love you guys. But, um... I forgot what I was saying. Ah, that happens a lot. Especially after working two doubles this weekend. Oh my gosh, I've had so much to do. It's unreal. But yeah, so if you're any outsider watching these videos, and if you have kids that you need stuff for, go to the websites and get the free stuff. You know, it's not my fault that you didn't sign up. Pretty much. It's out there. It's for everybody. And, you know, if you really have that much of a need for it, then, you know, I guess you can contact me and I'll point you to the way. But, you know. But we get a lot of hate constantly. We get too much hate to be hating each other. It's supposed to be a kind of stick together type thing. And, um, you know, like sisters, like if I'm, you know, fighting my little sister, which I, yeah, I have a little sister. <laughs> you guys will probably never see her in here, but if I ever uh, have a problem with my little sister, you know, a little fight or something, you know, I can, we can fight and, you know, it'll be okay. But if somebody were to step to her and, you know, I would stick up for her. But the Reborn community is not like that. It's like high school. Whenever there's five t different tables. You've got a certain girl sitting at one and a certain girl sitting at another. It's called cliques. And some of them, um, a lot of people are in their little cliques here. But it shouldn't really be like that, you know. Because I love the people with the high dollar Reborns. I love the people with the low dollar Reborns. I really could care less. I just want to watch y'all. <laughs> you know, when you watch different people, you find out different things. Like, different things that you're allowed to do with your Reborns and can't. You know, everybody experiments. Everybody has problems with a certain paint or a certain rooting tool. You just kind of, you know, it's kind of like reviewing the products. So... That's what I like to do. Cause you got a little side pony there. <laughs> Look at you. Look at you. Let everybody have it. She got her toy. She's got her toy. I really want to do a video this week, guys, with her giving her little sister a bath. So we're gonna try to do that. Um, this is Minnie Mouse. This is actually vintage. It's from the 70s, I believe. I'm pretty sure it was the 70s. I bought it off of eBay. And I won it for like some cents. But it said it was a vintage t-shirt. I'm really into vintage clothes. 1984. That's a long time ago. <laughs> and um, it doesn't say anything on there. It's just her on a little carousel. And... It's really cute. I love the pastel colors. It's nothing but pastel. It's got pastel purple, pastel blue green, pink, and Minnie Mouse looks so cute with her little horse. Hey, you look so cute. Oh, her eyelash is falling off. I'm really upset about that. That's why I really don't, you know, fool with her too much anymore. I don't want her eyelash to completely fall off. But another thing, my friend. Misty Sealock came to my job and she dropped off a beautiful little present. It came in this box with a, uh, it looks like a snow globe on top of the box, which I'm keeping it. And I love it. I've been playing with it for like two days. Don't ask me why. <laughs> but she also dropped off some pacifiers. These are the ones I've been wanting for <sighs> a year now. Ever since I met her, I think, when I first met her, I've been wanting these. So it's been a while. And, you know, they came with two, so, obviously, for the twins. And that will probably be the first pacifiers I try to put on them. 
as long as they match their outfits. Um, sorry I look a mess, guys. Um, I did have a long week, and then a long weekend, and today I'm going to have a busy day. So I'm kind of saving up all my energy into putting my, making myself look good this evening. <laughs> and um, I will hope to get their dad on video because his birthday is on March 15th, no, March 14th, and mine is on March 15th. So hopefully we'll do like a birthday thing or, you know, do something special for you guys to watch. But uh, thank you for watching. Amisa says thank you for sitting through our talk. And we love you guys.